Angela Tebert is known as Lacey Wild. And take a wild guess what she's known for. If you can't guess, you're blind. Hey everyone, I'm Sandra Matos. Thanks for tuning in to IO2. In the last episode, I asked you what word would you use to describe Justin Bieber? Here's what some of you had to say. <gasps> Oh, come on. Now that's just mean. Lacey Wilde has had 36 surgeries to achieve her plastic Barbie doll look. You may have seen her on reality shows like TLC's My Strange Addiction or E's Botched. Now after 12 boob drops, she wants one more. She wants to upgrade herself from a triple L to a triple Q. She's also gone on a dangerous crash diet in order to look perfect. Her goal is to get down to a size zero. She eats only one apple a day, and in the last six weeks, she's lost over 20 pounds. Several doctors have warned her to stop, but she wants to have the most extreme body in the world. She wants to be a walking cartoon character. The mom of six is known as the most extreme surgery patient in the world, and she wants to keep pushing the limits. Hopefully, she doesn't push until the point of no return. Now, expecting mommies, listen up. Breastfeeding your babies will make them smarter and richer. There was a unique study done in Brazil on mothers breastfeeding versus mother who did not breastfeed. The results show that the longer the baby was breastfed, the more benefits it got out of life. 3,500 newborns were studied over a period of 30 years. When they were 30 years old, they were given an IQ test. The babies that were breastfed scored higher. They were more intelligent and had higher earnings. So there is such thing as smart juice. Next up, I'm guessing this woman was not breastfed. In Alice Springs, Australia, a stupid mom used her baby as a weapon in a fight. There are no details on the shocking fight or how it ended up on the street. But this woman grabbed her one-year-old by the ankles and swung the baby at the man she was fighting with. Whatever happened to a can of mace? The baby was rushed to the hospital after she dropped it on the floor. <sighs> Thankfully, there were no serious injuries. This mother, on the other hand, must have suffered a previous head injury. And there you have it. That's what's going on in the news. I'm Sandra Matos. Thanks for watching IO2. And as always, be sure to like, share, and subscribe for more news.